Alrighty, well, good evening, everybody. Well, um, I thought I'd go ahead and, um, kind of like yesterday, I want to showcase uh, a new and improved team. Um, I'll I'll go more in depth on it here in a, in a moment, but um, like I usually do, uh, I'm gonna have some music running in the background. Um, this time around, it's gonna be Knights of Nivral, their Nitronauts album. So I have played this album before in like other videos. So it just this wasn't a this wasn't an active choice. It's just. You know, playing, you know, just got a shuffled playlist, and this is just what randomly came up. So let me. I'm uh, I'm kind of doing this video by the seat of my pants. This is totally improv. So. Okay, so let's lock it up. There it goes. So. Anyway, um, so throughout this stream. Um, I've been playing this team. I have made a video about this before. Uh, the Thunderboids. Now, okay. now for a brief period because this team actually got beat by a treasure team. I think, or it had um, it had the mythic High King Iron Gut in there, but uh, but still, you know, uh, King Iron Gut and three uh three tre you know three treasure troops uh, yeah after losing to a team like that i changed their name to to the shitbirds it just after losing to a team like that i can't couldn't justify having thunderboys on there well as of recent i managed to beat i managed to complete a kingdom challenge like from all the way up here to level 206 um most of it being being the thunderboids team um because of that achievement i went ahead and changed the name back i figured that i figured they're up i figured they they earned it i mean being able to being able to complete level 200 plus battles yeah that definitely accounts for something so Changed them back to the Thunderboids, um, and then after uh, playing these guys for a while, but yeah, just just some leftovers from my stream. So I managed to get them to level seventy. So finally, which meaning um. You explode one yellow gem on four and five gem matches. This made the team a lot easier to use. So, and plus, I don't. For a while too, um, I was also having to use the. Uh, I was having to use Staff of Storms because um, my opponent had a harder time. Um, counter-attacking me, for lack of a better word. If, um, if I just blew the board, exploded all the yellow gems, and just, you know, because then what comes down afterwards is random, then, uh, then to have a, a weapon like this, Nimbus Bow, that creates, uh, six blue and yellow gems, and just, put, you know, places them on the board for my opponent to use. So, yeah, for a while I was using Staff of Storms, well, now that I got level 70, I actually found this to be definitely be the better weapon now. So, all I need is basically one single four match out of all that, and it's going to create this big, huge chain reaction. So, didn't really get that from Staff of Storms. So, I'm going to go ahead and, um, Just, if for no other reason than because I'm here, like I like I usually do, I'm going to do a, again, that's, this is leftovers from my stream. And then, I guess before I forget again, to, to give the uninitiated an idea as, how, as to how this team works, I have three of these in my, in my team, um, it's, basically an anti-yellow an anti-yellow build 
but it's they're they're also pretty tanky. Reduce damage from skulls by 50%, but the uh, big one. Give four to all skills on all Strix allies when matching four or more gems. And um, I have three finesses, so basically this is gonna give me 12. Plus 12 to all skills on all, all Strixies, you know, when matching four or more. And then again, if the, this is an anti yellow team, if there's a storm, which there's almost always going to be, give six mana to all other allies. Meaning, I don't have to, I don't have to go clucking for, uh, yellow matches as much. As long as I can get, as long as I can get one of them at full mana, and, as lo and the second guy at at least five mana, I could just continuously chain these guys over and over and over, a continuous loop. Kind of like the, uh, my Chalcedony build. In fact... I can find her, you know, something like this. A uh, pretty popular troop right here. Creates a bunch of brown gems. And she uses brown so she can loop. Well, the Thunder Boys can sort of kind of do the same thing as well. So, but, once again, you're... I'll, I'll explain more in the game. And then, well, he's a storm caller. And he's gonna have a light storm every turn. Deals two damage. Um, I guess this can be uh, kind of in my wish list, but I mean, I probably won't, I wouldn't even get out of bed for just two damage. I mean, just really nothing to write home about, especially with the kind of content that I do. Like explore 12, PvP, and that kind of thing. So I think this needs a buff. I mean, if I was to venture a guess, deal five damage to a random enemy. So, but anyway, so yeah, once again, level seven, level 70, explode a yellow jump on four or five matches. And Nimbus Bow, um, damage an enemy, uh, 44, oh, that's what I was wanting to say, Stormcaller, he too is a Strix, so, um, yeah, it's, it's still gonna be 12, I thought my math was wrong, it was gonna be 16, but no, so yeah, basically it's going to create a mix of uh, 24 blue and yellow, if, if, if my math is right. Oh, and then over over here, over on the right, um, using this uh, weapon will enchant you. It'll silence the first enemy, so there's a bit of, there's a bit of planning involved. It creates a yellow, and again, it also enchants you, so. But anyway, let's, um, let's go ahead and do a battle or two. So, uh, big priority is um, looking for green and purple. Um, uh, green is the bigger priority than purple. Trying to get him fired up. Although, I totally forgot these are Explore 12, so if you don't think uh, your top guy can take the hit, you might want to go with... Uh, Prioritize skull damage above all that. And plus he's stunned as well, so this may not have been the most ideal battle to showcase this team. Okay, there we go. So. And then Usually um I'll usually I don't target the guy on the top. But I'll target like somebody like way down here at the bottom. So. But then you want to go after the uh, four and five matches. So. And. But 
I want to keep him silenced for as long as possible. And then, using the bow again, if it looks like you can one-shot somebody, then I'll use him to, to finish that person off. And then it'll also refresh the silence on the top guy. But, uh, I'm not getting his... I'm not getting as much stats because my top guy here is stunned, so... But... Again, the uh, Thunderstrike, it's, it's, it's exploding gems on a... four or five matches. And then, just... Just to end with a flourish. Finish it off like that. And then, um... Yeah. So... Well, and again, this is an anti-yellow team, so I'll go ahead and risk the stunner too. Because... Three of the troops here are yellow, so I'm gonna I'm gonna deal double damage against them. So I'll go ahead and do another. Um, so we got a perp here. And here we go. We got a five match. And another. So, because he can, because he can inflict stun, um, I'm gonna aim for the top guy. The sooner I get him out of there, the better. Okay, so oh, 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 oh. poor match. But again, every time, mom. Um, once again, every time I get a 4 or 5 match, it increases everybody's stats by 12. So, definitely want to go hunting for those. And then, I should have enough. So, let's finish him off, and that'll silence the next guy at the bottom. Once again, just kind of as a like kind of as a big finish. Hoping for some explosions, but oh, didn't happen. Oh, hold on. Well, my team's not. Yeah, so we got got three yellows, and this is a big surprise here. And I said this during my uh, stream as well. Um, Stormheim here, I believe. Um, uh, yeah. Their trade stones are all blue. So I thought it as a big surprise that uh a lot of these monsters are actually yellow. When doing the uh when doing the kingdom challenge here, that big surprise. So Um uh, but I'll probably do one more battle here and then I'll I'll try a PvP battle. They're at least in my mind they're not that viable. They might be good against like the uh the easier to beat teams, the, like the the joke novelty ones, but against like the uh, the full blown Zolgoth groups, <laughs> good luck. And he can be silenced. The top guy, I mean. So, um, I'll go for the guy that's not yellow. Finish him off. There's a 
fiber. Oh, wow. So let's go ahead and break off of here and then I'm gonna try doing a PvP battle or two But again, I don't Yeah, I guess a team like this um, Half of them are yellow uh, Yeah, elementalists are always a no-go You know what But uh, like I said, I don't I don't really have high hopes on this one start but um and I also said this during my stream as well um this kind of content though PvP um maybe uh the mid tier explorers or mid level explorers are pretty much in this uh team's wheelhouse okay I'll probably want to leave that alone I'm gonna use a bow cause low health low armor it means uh battles don't last that long it, it becomes a less tedious team to use because like I said um you can you can potentially get an infinite loop going um, kind of like the Chalcedony group which means that's gonna be a whole lot of button pressing but yeah it's the same problem I had without Chalcedony it gets pretty tedious so let's um yeah big priority let's nail him Well, I'm getting the matches. That definitely helps. Um, how much damage? 104? Yeah. So, he's definitely got to go. He has a life and death weapon. So, yeah, he's got to go bye-bye. And, let's see. Oh. Took him out. I think he was yellow, too. So... I think we have this battle in the bag. Yeah. Holy shit. Well, did it. Um, I have no way to untangle the web spinner. I mean, ideally, I could probably silence him. But that's about it. But I guess since I'm here... Oh! <laughs> okay, but I'm just going to call this battle a fluke. Ah, yes, the tragic flaw on this team. If you don't get a four match, I think I might have said this earlier, if you don't get a four match out of any of this, you're pra you're practically handing your opponent the victory, especially if they use uh, blue and yellow mana. It was why I switched to sweat the Staff of Storms. So if I don't get anything out of that, it's less punishing. Not gonna bother going with the skull matches because they make so many of them.
There we go. Oh, not apparently. Jeez. But yeah, like I like I said, I'm calling that victory a fluke. I mean, Web Spinner got uh, got battle crashed. Alrighty, but uh, anyway, that's that's what I wanted to do in this video. Just want to do a showcase of uh, of uh, my new team. It's uh, the Thunderboys version 2.0. So, but but yeah, uh, I'm gonna. Uh, uh, okay, this I forgot to say this at the start of my stream, but uh, but yeah, I'm um, I'm actually also actually want to make this a quickie video because I still have to go. I still gotta um, I still have to go grocery shop. So. Yeah, I haven't even gotten started on my blog post yet. So, yeah, definitely have to do that when I get back. But, but anyway, I'm kind of babbling, so, but thanks for watching, everybody. I appreciate that, and uh, I'll, I'll see you all next time. Bye for now.